Well, hello, I'm back. Things are back, and this is the Saturday wrap for Saturday, the 12th of September 2020, autumn. And the word or phrase of the week is changes. I was thinking of perpetual changes because of autumn, and it's a yes track, but I decided not to. And there are reasons for that. Here is one. Uh, Back on the Horny Goat by Brad D. Tutlow. And there is a reason for that. Um, I'll come on to that later. You probably already guessed. Yeah. So, um, starting last week, um, things were looking good. I needed to get away. Um, I had a bacon roll in the back garden which I put onions with and only recognised I put onions with once I'd cooked it however, grown the own onions red onions and lovely so, be knowing um, I had leave hint there I booked for, well from the 18th onwards, so I booked a couple of nights away in Exeter and I also booked a couple of nights away in Hereford You can probably guess why Hereford. And I had plans for other bookings. Hmm. So, yeah. um, Yeah, Caffili's in lockdown again. And it's like, oh, okay. So, dig out the stuff that works during lockdowns. Bragdy Tut Lol Horny Goat. Um, Yeah. I've got to be honest, it's no biggie. Um, my premier in booking, uh, you can choose various costings. I choose the cheap, uh, cheese, chose, chose the cheapest, uh, which you can't get a refund, but um, you can just move it on. And I moved it on a month, which might have been overly optimistic. Um, who knows? Um, but it was fine and it was cheaper. Um, Travel Lodge, uh, they stopped their refunds uh, back in June, which I didn't want to refund. I just wanted to rebook. So I have rebooked, but that's a fiver. I might ping them and say, there's lots of parts of the country that are now in lockdown. You might want to consider that. I have been a loyal, etc, etc, etc. <laughs> oh, and um, I plan to be in Hereford today. Um, can't be uh can't come in and can't come out of the county unless you're a key worker and that's only for work um so no traveling through or whatever and remain locked down so i had a bit of a sleep in which was unusual for me anyway talking of changes um perhaps it's slightly better i'm not in hereford today i don't like driving on well, it's not even a motorway. The M4 is, but the uh, A449 is a dual carriageway, and it's already dark. Uh, anyway, going to work. I got my letter. I'm working in Rhonda Cannon Taff, which is currently experiencing a shadow ban. If you know Twitter, you'll know about that. And, uh, oh, itchy nose. And uh, so is Murtha. And the sports bar place just along from where I work, uh, that's been shut down due to a COVID-ness. Apparently, we are in a lockdown because people are congregating in homes and have been tracked and traced. And we're leading the UK in cases and our numbers and that. No one's been prosecuted yet. However, um, because the policy is have a go at the car drivers, uh, police were stopping uh, people all over the county, including the bottom of Nangaro Hill, and checking on them. Yeah, but no one who's actually broken the rules. Hmm. And of course, car drivers are going to work to pay the taxes, to pay for the Welsh Assembly Government, and I'm still calling you that. Um, yeah. Easy target, really good, can have you. Mm. So I'm not happy about that. Um, however, 
strangely enough, the pubs are still open, and that's because track and trace is showing um, people aren't getting infected in pubs. And I can't speak for other pubs, but I've been to the Malcolm Uphill and I've been to the Tumble Inn, and you have to give up your track and trace on the door, and you have to stand back and you have to sanitize, and they are well run. So all those people are close asking for pubs to be shut down. Perhaps you might want to aim your ear against those people who are at home and catching it. He says. Anyway, um, on to TV. Uh, I, it was a Sunday afternoon. I wasn't sure of what to watch, and I was thinking of firing up Plex and all that sort of business. And um, on the front of the Apple TV, uh, they have the Netflix stuff. I think they have the Netflix stuff. And there was a thing called Away, which is, you know, a soap opera in space, going to Mars and such like. And I was watching For All Mankind during the first lockdown, and that was very similar. And I've watched Mars, and uh, now I'm hooked. Okay, it's not hard on science fiction. It's science fiction with, here's the real people who have emotions. And I know people have said that every episode has something to solve and there's a bit of emotional stuff and that's the way it is. I reckon I just must be a sucker for that sort of stuff. I am. Oh, two seconds. Oh, by the way, having bacon out in the back garden today. Because not going anywhere. Um, so, Away, um, there is a second series, um, I googled it and then it showed up on my Android phone all the time, with lots of spoilers, yeah, Google, Android, Adi yes, talking of that, Android 11 hit this week, and because I've got a 3A, immediately it was there, I think it was about 1.2 1.3 gigabytes. Anyway, did it at home, downloaded like the wind. The update process far, far faster. Changes are, well, for me, minimal. I know there's a screen recorder in there now, and there's no bubbles for various messaging apps and such like. Um, it's supposed to be buggy. I haven't found any bugs yet. Um, but there you go. So anyway, um, yeah, um, working in Ronda Cunningham, which has a shadow lockdown, which is everything the lockdown is, but it's voluntary. Yeah, and I have heard um, in the Ronda Valley, home bargains and Asda, everyone came out and went crazy for toilet roll. Yes. You can see why we're back in lockdown, because we learn nothing. We learn nothing at all. Hmm, so um, there we are. I am refreshed uh, due to a long overnight sleep. It's a little bit cloudy. Uh, I was going to mow the lawn, but that's still a little bit, well, it's still got dew on there. Or oh, was it the overnight rain? Tomorrow's looking better. And Monday, real Indian summer, 24 degrees Celsius. I don't know what that is in Fahrenheit. Um, but it's good enough for me. However, I mean work. Um, carry on working. Um, I cancelled my leave. Um, if I'm going to be at home, I'd probably just check my email. And if I'm checking my email, I might as well be in work. We shall see. Anyway, I'm lucky. I've got the tech. I've got the job. Um, I can travel about a bit. And even though we're in lockdown, I could go to pubs. But I don't think I will. Because I have the horny goat. So, look after yourself. Sanitize, uh, stay safe, and um, I'll see you next week. Bye bye.